Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome to a FIFA 18 pack opening video. Today we have got a very special episode. And that's because, as you guys can see by the pack on the screen, the Winter Wants to Watch cards are now available. So in this video, I'm going to open roughly around 10 of these packs. Hopefully out of that we could maybe get lucky and get one of the big cards such as Alexis Sanchez, Aubameyang. Honestly, I'd even take a player like Batshuayi because I think it'd be a perfect fit for one of my teams. And at the moment... During this recording, he is having an amazing debut for Dortmund, so potentially already going to get an upgrade. Anyway though, if you guys do enjoy this video, it would be greatly appreciated if you could smash the like button. Let's see if we can hit 1,200 likes. Of course, do subscribe if you're new around here as well. But anyway, with the introduction out of the way, we'll go into this very first pack. Right, so hopefully we can start with something pretty decent. Of course, every single one of these is actually going to be a one to watch. I'm doing the untradeable one, so if it isn't something that I want to, want to keep, I will actually recycle it into another pack. We are going to get Jao Pereiro. Sorry, Jao Mario. Um, bit of a mix between Jao Mario and Jao Pereira there by accident. For an 83 rated card, he actually looks okay. I mean, do I want to be keeping this? Probably not. I will end up recycling it. But our first card is actually a Premier League ones to watch as well, which is decent look, I suppose. When I did actually see the Portuguese flags, I knew it was going to be this card. Of course, transferred to West Ham. Yeah, it is It is one I'm going to recycle, and hopefully in the next pack we can get the card that we might want to keep. Right, so then, attempt number two. Another card that I'd really like to have, of course, is going to be Virgil van Dijk, a Liverpool player. We've also got Coutinho, excellent Liverpool player. And also, Lucas Moura, another Brazilian, would be a nice addition. Another card that I would probably keep. Let's see who it's going to be this time around. Of course, every single... It's going to be an Everton player. It's Tucson. I can't believe we've actually got an Everton card in the second pack. Again, another Premier League player. Every single one of these looks like they are going to walk out. But it is not a card that I want. Definitely one that is going to be recycled, of course. Myself being a Liverpool fan. And to be fair, the card... Doesn't look great neither. He is a striker, 78 rated, 73 pace. Not really usable in the Premier League, in my opinion. Much better alternatives. Not to say that this guy isn't going to be a hit at Everton. It's just not one of the cards that I want on FIFA 18. Right, so on to pack number three. Every single one to watch card we have got so far actually been from the Premier League. Do you know what? I wouldn't mind one of those main cards. Like I mentioned, Aubameyang and Alexis Sanchez. The previous one, Tucson from Everton. There is actually a couple of Everton cards, the one being Phil Walcott, who is potentially one that I would keep as well. Obviously, had an amazing debut. We are going to get... I'm not sure, actually. Oh, again, another player. Okay, it is one of the lowest rated cards, but another Premier League player. Plays for Brighton. I mean, again, ugh, he's probably going to have a few upgrades throughout the year if he does have a good impact in the Premier League. But a 76 rated card... Realistically, after getting a couple of informs, you're looking at maybe 83 rated. So, it is unfortunately, again, going to be another card that we recycle. Alright, this time around, let's see what our luck is going to bring. I'm interested to see the flags. Oh no, it's actually going to be the lowest rated card in the ones to watch us. 75 rated. He's got 90 pace, he's got 78 dribbling. Bundesliga, I believe it's that Kosovo. I'm not too sure with the nationality. But again, guys, this is not the player that we want. It is not one of the cards that we're going to use in any of our squads. Again, it's going to have to get recycled. Unfortunately, we get the lowest rated card we possibly could have got out of this pack. Right, so I believe at the beginning I did mention I'd open around 10 of these packs. This, if my calculations are correct, is the fifth one. So putting us directly halfway through the video, yet to get a duplicate. Let's see if we can get... Maybe 85 rated or above. There are only a few ones to watch cards that are of that criteria. French, CDM, Bordeaux card. It's my 80. Okay, 81 rated. Not going to lie. Stats look great. Again, though, not a card that I'm interested in. We are only here for the big guys. So, unfortunately, it's one that is going to have to get recycled yet again. I did already mention his card does look very good. 81 rated. I believe this is actually an inform, so... Already had an upgrade, even though his own just recently joined Bordeaux from Monaco. Still, though, not one of the players that we want. Let us see the Chilean border. That'd be absolutely insane. I know he does play for Manchester United, but come on. Alexis Batshuayi. Do you know what? This is one that I did I mention during the introduction. 80 rated Michi Batshuayi. Did say as well, currently scored two goals on his debut. 
you know what? This is probably going to get a, a fairly nice upgrade as well. Being from Borussia Dortmund in the Bundesliga, very desirable club, especially when it comes to hybrids. I'm honestly in two minds right now. Considering these packs literally cost nothing to build, especially when you do have a lot of players in the club, I think I might actually keep this Minchie Batch away. It's the first one out of six that we have opened, where it's a card that I actually want. Let's see if we can go for back to backs in cards that I actually want to keep. It'd be very nice to see Virgil van Dijk inside of one of these, as did already mention being a Liverpool fan. Don't. Oh my. Wait. No! I'm going to have to discard one. Unless I do the method where a back out of Ultimate Team. Duplicate. They are untradeable as well. This is actually going to be such a dilemma. I'm not sure what I'm going to have to do here. Potentially back out of Ultimate Team. And recycle one of the batch ways I already have into an SBC. Because as you guys can see, both duplicates can't store them in the club as they are untradeable. Right, so seven packs down and we got our first one to watch duplicate. It was actually one of the better cards though to be fair, so not too disappointing. Did manage to recycle the untradeable batch way. And now it's actually telling me to go and store the other one into the club. So quickly I'll go ahead and do that. Fortunately, I was able to back out and didn't have to discard the one which we previously pack pulled. This time around, though, let's see what it's going to give us. I'm hoping for someone good yet again. French sent Laporte. Yo, this is a card I'm going to keep. 84 rated Laporte, now in the Premier League for Manchester City. If this card gets an upgrade as well, it'll be fantastic in my opinion. It's got some really nice stats across the board and obviously sent back to the Premier League. Always decent for squad builders. So, again, another card here that I'm actually going to keep and not recycle this time into a future SBC. Right, so our pack looks actually improved in the second half of the video. With only two packs remaining, let's hope it can get even greater. Um, again, Mikatarian as well, Arsenal would be a card that I'd be looking for to store into the club. Realistic, though, without being... Without <sighs> Tucson again. But like I was saying, without being too... Stingy, I would like to see myself get a Virgil van Dijk. I'm sure that's not too much to ask for from the EA God, but unfortunately, 78 rated Tucson. Obviously, already had this card before, so with only one remaining, one pack to go, we'll go ahead and recycle him into another SBC. Let's see if we can finish on potentially Virgil van Dijk or one of the bigger cards. Okay then, guys, here it is, 10th time lucky. Let's see what it is going to give us this time around. Honestly, if it's not one of the big cards, I probably... It's going to be... We get Laporte again. 84 rated. As you guys know, it is going to be a duplicate. I don't think can finish on a duplicate, right? I cannot finish on a card that we've already pack pulled. So, even though this is technically the 10th, and what I was going to say final pack, I'll go ahead and recycle this one into another SBC. And let's finish on a card that we have not yet pack pulled. Hopefully, being one of the main guys. Right, okay then, guys. Let's see what we can finish on this time around. I would just like to see the Dutch flags and get Virgil. It's going to ink Barkley? Right, mid? All right, we're going to be getting ourselves a Theo Walcott. Of course, 91 pace, 80 dribbling. Is that one of the cards that I have not yet got? As I did already mention, scored two, two goals on debut, so potentially... Going to get an upgrade already. As a result, I want to watch card I'm happy to finish on. So I'm not actually going to recycle this want to watch card instead. Phil Walcott is going to sit happily inside of my club. Now if you guys have enjoyed this video, it would be greatly appreciated if you could smash the like button. Let's see if we can hit 1,200 likes. Of course, if you guys are new around here as well, it would be greatly appreciated if you could subscribe. But other than that, as did mention, unfortunately, does bring to the end. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and hopefully I'll see you next time a few moments later